So here's how the uh, outlaw build turned out, guys. Let me spin it around. There's how she turned out. Get these off. This off. And that off. The only thing with the outlaw, I kind of messed my tail up. I cut it out a little too much. But I already ordered another one for like five bucks. I just repainted. I just knew it was messed up. But there's how the body turned out. And here's how it looks underneath. It's got a battery. Oh, I never unplugged that. Got the battery. I just ran the motor sensor wire under here to kind of protect it. Uh, it looks like a mess, but I have it all jammed in there. So I'm running a, uh, a 3481. First time I ran it at the track, I got second qualified. In the main, my freaking spindle came off. My screw came out because I didn't lock tighten it. But that's fixed. I uh, probably would have got second in the main. I've already tuned on some springs. See the different colors. I left the pit or the kit on the rear. I did put heavier shock fluid on the right side. I made my own mixture. I had some uh, 35 and some 90 weight. And I put about a quarter of the shock body with 90 and filled it up with 35 and i'm telling you it works freaking perfect at the track um this is going to be run on only oval so and it's hard pack so a lot of body roll i did order these we run slicks but i wanted something to kind of look good on it so i did order the pro line uh, show times so yeah, just to, I don't know, try them out. A lot of people run uh, a groove tire at that track, but it's hard pack. So, but these are really, really soft. They do come with the covers. It's the show times. You just pop them in there and there's some screws and then when you're ready to race. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm good to go. Got the Futaba servo in i just left the whatever came with the kit horn works good got the uh hobby wing just stock xr10 <clears throat> the just stock 13.5 this is the combo they run where i'm at uh this is the spec class it's a motor and speed control all together for 100 bucks but i'm running about a four second lap so it's plenty fast enough i did order the rj speed kit it is made for carpet but some people run it on phone but there's no videos out there the rj speed so i ordered the wingless sprint it sort of looked like this and i ordered the one with the wing and i'm gonna run a four and a half turn motor in it oh yeah hold on i'll be right back let's see i had some shipments come in today so I am going to build another one. It won't be the custom works, but I'm going to play with it. It's going to be a modded four and a half turn. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to play with it all. And then the XR10 Pro. It's brand new. That's 200 bucks, 100 bucks, 300 bucks, and just motor and speed control. I could stick it in here, but I'm not because I'm leaving this where I can race it. But I am going to play with a modded sprint car just to do it also if you want to keep watching i'm about to build this i wanted something modded so i looked at one guy makes it run 70 mile an hour so i ordered this it's a uh a uh, 2245 kv brushless motor this dude should turn on. I haven't stuck it on the analyzer yet. But this bad boy should get it. Especially in this little mini B. And the Hobby Wing uh, BL30. Because, I mean, it's a small motor. This should push it pretty quick. 
uh other than that guys thank you for watching stay tuned i'm gonna be making more rc hobby content recommendations but uh yeah so there you go peace out